A Hopkins company is making a name for itself by taking on a problem that few people want to talk about, lice. That's right. If you're a parent, you know it can come with the territory. It's estimated 6 to 12 million kids get lice each year. It's how two local mothers got into a business of their own. And in just five years, they're turning their company, Ladybugs, into an international business. We are the ladies after the bugs. Rachel Knutson and Lisa Rudquist have a healthy dose of humor about lice. We have to be um, supportive to the client and just say, you know, you will, you will get through this. You will. Again, Lisa and I would have never have guessed that this is what we were going to do with our careers. As nurses and mothers, they've been through what Chan Hassan dad Andy Moss experienced. You know, we're at home one night and our kids have been complaining about their heads itching. When Lisa and Rachel's daughters each got lice, the two nurses weren't happy with their treatment options. We found that when you open up a bottle of a chemical preparation to treat your child for head lice, you know as a mother that there's something in there you don't want to put on your kid. Five years ago, the pair developed ladybugs. We have our prevention products and our elimination products. A line of at-home products designed to eliminate lice without pesticides. Mint is our main essential oil in our products, and that's what lice find offensive, and so they will crawl away from that scent. The products are now sold at Great Clip stores nationwide and in Canada, turning ladybugs into a $1.5 million company. First thing, though, that we did try using the kit itself to try to get rid of things and uh, and then realized with three in the family that it was probably a better idea to just go have somebody take care of it. Andy Moss oh, yeah. brought his family directly to the Ladybugs facility where they treat the problem on site with a special device. Gentle assurances line the walls of this company signaling to nervous families they're definitely not the first or only ones dealing with lice. We love speaking to those families, helping them understand, kind of reigning in that anxiety. Ladybugs will find out later this month if they're awarded Emerging Entrepreneur of the Year by the Twin West Chamber of Commerce. Somebody's got to take it on, and they I did. Guess. <laughs>